Greeting goals and deepers and welcome back to my channel. This time I'm gonna highlight my entire 4K collection. So let's just dive it in. The first movie I got is Lord of the Rings, the first three films on 4K, the special ultimate edition. And the next one I got is Blade Runner 2049. A really, a really good one. Basic, basic Instinct on 4K. I haven't checked this transfer out. Have I had this one? I have, I have had this one for quite some time, but I haven't checked it out. And the next one is a really pink one, Barbie. Went to see it to see it. Did not finish it because my wife got sick? But need to check it, finish it some sometime. Next one is Creepshow, one of my favorite films of all time. And the next one is The Steel Book of Cap in the Woods, one of my favorites also. Children of the Corn, the Arrow edition, a really, a really good one, looks amazing. And the next one is Company of Wolves, one of my favorite films of all time. Highly, highly recommend it if you haven't seen it, especially around the Halloween season. And the next one is Dark Crystal, highly recommended. Uh, all the films I have here are some of my favorite. I only buy for case of my favorite films, like Escape from New York, one of my favorites also. I'm just going to stop and say my favorite, or I will be here all day to say my favorite, favorite, favorite. Evil Dead, it looks amazing on 4K. A really, really nice transfer. I know why people complain about this one. I really, really like it. Really like the high definition on it. I like like the image. I like the sound. It's a great film. One of my favorites also. Okay, now I'm gonna stop. The fuck, John Carpenter's one on 4K. Also looks amazing. And the next one is Fifth Element on 4K. Also looks amazing. I haven't checked the transfer on this one out. It's Highlander. I am always been a big fan of Highlander. I haven't seen the other ones in ages. Used to watch all of the time, but I haven't seen it. The next one is the new E, the first part. Never watched it. I need to watch it. I really want to buy the second one to own all of them and watch everyone in order. Independence Day. One of the greatest 90s films of all time. And here's one of my favorite 90s films, Jumanji. I used to watch this so often as a kid. I used to rent it all the time. And then I owned it on DVD. I know it what happened. And this is the pick of the 4K. And the next one is Labyrinth. Also a classic. One of my favorite silly films. And that's the 90s Mummy with Brenda Fraser. Hey, this looks a Amazing in 4K and sounds amazing. And the next one is Man in Black on 4K. This one is excellent, guys. The sound and the quality of this one is amazing. Highly recommended. And this is one of my favorite ones from my collection from my 4K collection. Uh, video wise, and that's Onward, the Disney one. I mean, the picture quality on this one is beyond amazing. And the next one is the 80s one of Foltergeist. And the next one is this one I can pronounce it, the Dario Argento. Like I said in my last video, I own most of Dario Argento's films. Some are 4K, like this one. I have birds of the crystal, crystal plumage somewhere. Prometheus. Looks and sounds amazing. A really, really underrated one. Ah, now we're talking. Return of the Living Dead on 4K. I'm going to watch this tonight. Definitely. Pump, pumpkin head. Rawhead Drax. I mean... It's a classic. It looks and sounds amazing. 
and the next one I I bought this only because it was like for two dollars or something and that's rampage. I really enjoy those big monster moves and for K, I need to buy more of them. And the next one, Star Trek Beyond, also like, you know, four bucks or something. Decided to pick it up just because it's cheap. I really like the film though. Sing, also cheap. Really like the film still. And the last one is a classic Scream on 4K. Looks and sounds also amazing. So here's my collection, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. See you guys next time. Bye.